So Cleveland beat Detroit, and then they're going to go play the Yankees. I should be interested. You know, no one is talking about Cleveland. They had to come from behind in that series against Detroit. Detroit was a feisty team. You know, the American League Central ain't no joke. I mean, you had Cleveland, Detroit, and Kansas City. Minnesota just missed the playoffs. So it, you had a real tough, feisty fight there. But Cleveland has a real legit team. Um, I watched them play. And I'm going to tell you something. If it wasn't for the Mets, the Guardians might be a team you'd have to watch out for. I think the Yankees should win the series. I'm a Yankee fan, so of course I'm going to pick the Yankees. But I'm going to tell you something. Cleveland got something to prove. And they probably the least... They're probably the least uh, decorated team in going because everyone is all about the Yankees and the Mets for that or the Yankees and the Dodgers. That's the one everybody want to see. But Cleveland got the... Cleveland would have the, the biggest... Dare I say, um, agenda because they haven't won in forever. You know, when the Cavaliers won in 2016, the, the Cleveland Guardians, what have you, kept coming close. They knocked on the door and lost a couple close World Series. So, to imagine if they get back again, you know, it's kind of like where they do it. And I think that that would almost tower over the Cavs winning the title because to think about it, if Cleveland was to win, that would be huge. You know, but I'm not. I don't. I, I, I think he's gonna do it. But it's gonna be a tough series, though. Cleveland always is tough. Cleveland is a tough team. They've had some talented teams. You know, they're one of those franchises over the last thirty plus years in baseball where you, I think Cleveland and Seattle, are like two of the teams, like you kind of wonder how come either didn't win or didn't get stake in and you know being a perennial contender because the, the talent was there. But it's not always about talent. One thing about with baseball. Unlike football and basketball, town alone don't guarantee you a chip or a trip, chip or a trip, because other things have to come into factor into favor. But um, but Detroit had a really good year and they will be back again. And I, I was very impressed. You know, it was it was a, it was an interesting battle. I'm going to tell you something. This postseason has definitely been one for the ages. You got some legit teams, you know. You got some real legit teams that you can see. And they've done a really good job, you know. Now, will the fans get back on board and will they, you know, feel baseball like that? That's another story in the grand scheme of things. But the ones that do understand, there's some real good baseball we are seeing. And Cleveland's got a good team. They're going to be a problem for the Yankees in some capacity. I think the Yankees will win the series, but they ain't going to be in a rollover. I don't think there'll be no pushover because they've definitely been battle-tested. And they've proven that they belong. So we shall see. But uh, they got by Detroit. Now they'll play the Yankees in the American League Championship Series. Final four begins. I think we're going to see some really good baseball between Cleveland and the Yankees and L.A. Dodgers and the Mets. I think you're in for uh, two great series. We'll see. But let me know who you like, who you pick. You know, of course, I'd like to see the Yankees and the Dodgers. But Cleveland and the Mets are like two hungry teams that you really want to have to deal with, you know. So anyway, let me know what you think. Please like, subscribe, welcome thoughts, comments, and I do respond. Thank you. Wash your hands. Keep your mind clear. Watch out for another shader if you like. Hit that membership. Stay safe. Stay blessed. Stay woke. Stay true. Stay free. Enjoy some of this October baseball. It's coming real soon. It's getting good. I'm out.